All right, I need to know what's down there. I really, really, really want to know what's down there. So many things. Such a big, dangerous hole. I, I need to know what's down there. So I'm going to do it. I'm finally going to buy the ring. Which might be a massive waste of money. I don't know. It depends on whether it's... Well, one, is it actually going to be effective enough? And two, am I going to find something down there that is of equivalent or better value than the money I'm going to spend on the ring itself? I don't know. But I really want to know. I'm really curious. Exploring's fun. And if I don't buy it now, I might never buy it. Because there's always going to be, be a reason not to buy it. I can always tell myself, I could spend this on leveling up instead. And that's always going to be the case. It's never going to change. So what better time than right now when I have the full amount of money? Let's do it. Hello, kitty cat. Knock, knock. Oh, there you are. Are you sleeping? Aw, she's napping. Stupid depth of field. Come on. There we go. Oh. Who are you again? <laughs> you do have a, a type. You know, I've got to wonder. How come I can't just steal the ring? She's literally a sleeping cat. And what's the worst she can do? Scratch me? Where does she even keep her wares? I don't even see a storage box. Are they just like in her fur? Anyway. Okay. 13,400 reduces damage from falling. Easier to connect to players who choose the same god. Can hear the... I'm really curious about that one. Can hear the voices of foes. That doesn't sound like that would actually help you. But I'm really intrigued by what that could actually do. And this one sounds really good, but it depends on how much you absorb. That's why I really wish these things actually told you these, these things. A modest but inexplicably disturbing ring. Absorbs HP for each enemy defeated. Peer too closely at the rare stone that forms the eye of this ring, and things that writhe and stir may come into focus. Ugh. Let's put that down. What about this thing? Ring worn by Roy the Explorer. Hear the inner voices of surrounding foes. Useful for locating hidden enemies and perhaps for a few other things as well. Huh. I'm, God, I'm so curious about these things. Useful for a few other things as well. Like, I'm so intrigued by everything in this game. What are those few other things? Like, I'm thinking maybe I can use this on the the stone woman. Who's right over there. Over, I'm pointing at the screen. Oh, she's over there. Yes, you can't even see my hand. You know, the stone woman over at the thing next to the person. Yeah, like maybe I could hear her thoughts. Well, she's not actually an enemy though, but still. Maybe I could hear her thoughts. Maybe I could converse with her. I don't know. What about this one? Depicting a leaping feline. Reduces damage from falling. Legend has it that when cats grow old, a force brews within them. And they are reborn as something new. Alright. Yes. I'm going to do it. It's going to be the best money I ever spent, or it's going to be the worst. I don't think it's going to be anything in between. Here we go. Goodbye, souls. Satisfied? I'll be around if you ever come back. Yeah, uh, what's your return policy, by the way? Is it okay if I return it slightly used? There we go. Okay, now before I go jumping down all willy-nilly down a gigantic hole of doom, of doom, um, I should probably spend my souls before I lose them. So, let's go do that. Hello! Alright, what do I want to upgrade? Um, I still want more vitality, to be honest, because I want to be able to wear more stuff without worrying about it and wrecking my rolls. I don't think, I, I don't feel like I need more strength or dexterity. Uh, no weapons that I've used or seen require anything higher than what I've got. That's not to say that's the only reason to increase them. Of course, they make you do more damage. They increase your health slightly. Uh, apparently, that increases my defense a bit. That inc increases my bleeding. What, what is that at the bottom? 
by bleeding bins. What the fuck is BNS? Bins. Please explain that game. The power? Bleed? Bleed and attack, but what does BNS stand for? I don't understand. What is the BNS? It seems irrelevant to the description. Eh, whatever. Anyway, let's not increase that. So, vitality and... I don't know. Honestly, endurance would be nice. A bit more stamina. It's always good. A bit more health is always good. It's a pretty hefty boost to health, actually. About 30. Actually, no, exactly 30. But it doesn't really help with anything else. In fact, it seems to help with nothing else. Maybe adaptability? A bit more movement? Increases my poise? What is my poise? I think my poise is my resistance to being stunned. Withstand the impact of attacks? Yes. It's always a good thing. It doesn't increase it massively, though. Hmm. Um. Right, my adaptability just feels really low. Let's up that. Alright, so what's my equipment weight at now? 59%? Okay, it's pretty good. Yeah, I'm gonna keep wearing this armor. And uh, see how it does. If I feel like I need to go further, then I can always go back to my old rag look. Oh, what about my helmet? I know I replaced it with something that was heavier. After that last boss fight. What have I got? Do, do, do. No, this is not where I need to be. That's where I need to be. Shitty D-pad. I fucking hate you, D-pad. You defective piece of shit. 5.2? Yeah, that's pretty heavy. Hmm. It is really, really good, though. To be honest, it's, like, really good. It's a really good helmet. Yeah, okay, I'll leave it on. Okay. It is time to go down. Journey. To the center of the earth. This probably isn't even earth, and I don't think I'm going to the center of it anyway, because that would be really far down, and there's no way I'm going that far down, but I'm going kind of close to the center of the earth, maybe a little bit, maybe like 10% of the way to the earth. No, probably not that far. Maybe more like 2.5% of the earth. Oh my god, I'm going. Ow. Okay, I was, see, I was worried about that. That. It wouldn't make me exactly immune to these fall distances, but it would make it so it hurts a lot less. And I was thinking if... I was thinking maybe I'm not going to have enough Estus flasks or healing items to get through this, but... We'll see. I think that was the furthest... I mean, that, that was really far. The rest of these don't seem as far. Anyway. Okay, what is down here? I'm so curious what's down here. <laughs> Help me. Okay, um, I'm a little bit nervous now. Right, what does this one say? I did it. Congratulations! I should leave my own message. I learned how to do that, by the way. It's just right in here. Um, what should I say? How does this work? What are these stars? What? Am I, am I just going to be saying star, 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 dot, dot, dot? I, you know what? Uh, forget this. Whatever. Oh, God. I just... Oh, I just pressed B. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, what is this? Radiant Life Gem, that is fucking worthless. No thank you. Can I please have something good? Please? Please? Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Ferris's Lockstone, ooh, that'll come in handy when I find another one of those creepy face things. Which I'm sure I will. Somebody died falling to this thing? Oh no, somebody died falling from here. Oh, you almost had it! I want to watch that again, because actually I might be about to do that. 
Looks like they hit. Yeah, and... Oh. It looks like they just phased through it. That's a little worrying. Yeah, okay. Try jumping. Thanks. Actually, no, they're probably right. Oh, that thing's a troll, isn't it? You're supposed to jump all the way to the corner. You're not supposed to get onto that little tiny spindly thing. Okay, um... I should probably use another Estus. How many life gems do I have? Yeah, I should use an Estus. Because I just barely survived that fall, the initial one. Okay. So, jump jump -a Do I even have enough room to sprint here? Oh my god. I didn't press the jump key, but I lived anyway. Whew. Okay. Right, right. Poison moss? Hmm, what is that? Oh, I've already got a bunch of it, apparently. Reduces poison buildup and cures poison. I've got so many items. Dark defense? I don't even know what that means. Spell uses? Doesn't matter. One day I'll look at all of those things and maybe, perhaps, use them. Not today. Nice. Good job. What about you? Um, either they didn't use a healing item, or they didn't have the ring. But if they didn't have the ring, how did they get down here in the first place? Hmm. Anyway. I'm thinking maybe if I jump over to that hole down there, maybe I can't jump across? I don't know if I want to fall down, though. Nah. What's in here? Thing is, um, if I keep going, oh, is there a ladder? Oh, whoa! Is the ladder up to another thing. But how do I get through this mess of sticks? I'm pretty sure if I just like sprint and jump, I'm gonna hit it and fall straight down. Maybe if I sprint and then roll, I could maybe, maybe roll under it. There's actually more stuff down there. There's so many places to go. Look at all that. I mean, I could go... Okay, so I can go down there if I can manage to get over there. I could potentially drop from up there down there and then get up to that thing here. Um, I can go straight this way. I can also go down more and there's another platform. Okay, well, let's go this way first. Bonfire ahead. Ooh. Comfort ahead, but be wary of head. What? Comfort ahead, but be wary of head. I, I, as in, like, something's gonna try to cut off my head? Grave of Saints. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Um. Be wary of head. Did I just hear laughing? The fuck was that? What is that? I'm pretty sure I just heard laughing. Look at that thing. I feel like if I walk inside of it, it's gonna close its maw. Be wary of head.
What the hell is so funny? Sadness. Can I talk to you? I have no reason to kill him at the moment. How did you die? Being summoned as a grace... What? Huh? What's just... What? What's happening? I have no idea what's happening. What? Huh? Summoned to the world... What? Do I need to kill somebody? What just happened? Being summoned to the world... How did I get summoned? I don't... I don't understand. Okay. I guess I'm going ahead. I don't know if I'm supposed to be killing a player or helping a player or what. Oh. I'm... Am I fighting this person? Wow, okay. Not exactly the best environment to fight somebody. How did that happen? I don't understand. I know you can get invaded, but that said summoning you to their world as if I had been... Like, they weren't invading me, but I was invading them? I don't understand. I, I don't understand. But thankfully it didn't appear to affect anything. Um, okay. I can't want that to happen again, because now I know I actually need to attack them. Is that because I'm in the Blue Covenant? Or what? I know people can invade me, but again, the message implied, like, I was invading them. Being summoned to the world of, not... Yeah, I, I don't know. I just feel sad for these people. Or, I don't even know if they're people. These creatures. Look at them. It's like ruined souls. Try comfort. <laughs> Walked outside the door, drank a potion, and died. Um, oh, wait a minute. Hold on. I didn't rest at the bonfire. I only lit it, which means I still don't have all my Estus flasks. Wait, what was that called? It's called Harville's Resting Place. Hmm, I don't see anything. Oh, hi. I feel like I have really low stamina. I'm not sure if I got affected by some sort of a debuff, or it's because I'm going through water. Hey, where are you going, buddy? Come here. Do, do you actually want to hurt me? Hello? You do. Large soul of a nameless soldier. Okay, uh, where did I come from? Oh god, what's the, what have I gotten myself into? Jesus Christ, this game is huge. Aw, I can almost fit. Alright, that's where I came from. Dwarf required a head. <laughs> you can't actually get through there, right? It doesn't look like there's anything in there. How do I... How do I get in there? 
Oh, you gotta drop down from above. Looks like there's a skeleton watching over us up there. Those feet coming down. I find it kind of hilarious that you're like a super skilled warrior, but you can't even jump over a waist high wall. Alrighty then. Onwards and upwards. As they say, whoever they are. Be wary of Trio Right. Eh, just a bunch of rats, whatever. Whoa, 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 wait, what? Use Ferris's lockstone on what? On the ground? Oh, it's a face on the ground. I meant to pick up this. Damn, I'm lucky that that item was there, because if I didn't try to pick up that item, I might not have noticed there's a screaming face in the ground. Well, um, yes, yes, I would love to. Oh, there's even another one. Trap. Trap? What's a trap? Using this Ferris's lockstone as a trap? I guess I won't use this one. Or is this a trap? Hmm. Hmm. I'm looking around for dastardly contraptions. How did you how did you die? Let's watch this person. Oh, being summoned as a gray spirit. Okay. Alright, let's do this. Come on, come on. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> I really want to fight somebody in a room, in a place where I actually have, like, room to move. The world of Dode. Okay, where are you? <laughs> Dode! Oh god, there's a bunch of rats! Oh, hi, dude. Good time to use my potion. Come back here. Where you going? Oh, you want me to come there? No. No, no, no. I like this place down here. You want the high ground? <laughs> Please don't attack me while I'm doing this. Alright, I'll be polite, of course. I'm not going to attack them while they're doing that. Alright. Where are you going? I haven't even opened that bridge yet. Come back here! <laughs> are you really going to make me chase you? Come on. I am supposed to attack them, right? I can't help them? I don't think I can help them. Okay, those aren't good. Um, yeah, okay. That's not good. Why are they attacking me? Not a good place to attack. Shit. Damn it.
I don't know what's up with these creatures. I don't understand how the creatures work in this PvP thing. Like, kind of ignoring me? I... I'm super confused. My armor's at... Oh god, I'm stepping in a puddle of crap. I think it just broke everything. That's not good. that not hit? Are you kidding me? Okay, just kill me. Dear God. I really don't understand what is even happening. Like, is this because I'm in the Blue Covenant? I'm automatically being dragged into the the guilty? Or is somebody summoning... In, did they invade me? I... What? Huh? Anyway. Oh. Oh. Are you fucking kidding me? In the other world, my shit stays broken? Well, god damn it. So, ev everything's broken. Wonderful. That, that's wonderful. I think I'm gonna go home now. I don't like this place. And that's not gonna fix it, obviously, right? Because they're broken? Yeah. Let's go topside, shall we? Okay, so pools of horrible acid that ruin everything you have. Understood. Got it. The Phoenix Parma. Also sounds like a delicious casserole. Parma. Mmm. Alright, how much is this gonna cost me? Okay. Oh, it's not too bad. Do I have enough for everything? No, I do not. Almost. Around, if you make it back. Almost. Probably got a shitty soul around here. Still saving these for the or perhaps part. To create something of great worth. Still waiting on what that might be. Is this 800? Yeah. Oh, fucking hell. Even my rings broke. Wow. I'll be around if you make it. <sighs> I'm not happy. I kind of regret going down there. What a shitty place full of shitty people. No. Soul of a Proud Knight, couple thousand, I'm assuming? Yeah, two thousand. Alright, that should be enough. I think, maybe. Repair all my shit. You again. Okay, what's the most important? Mm, stamina, definitely. Oh, and the Blue Covenant. I should repair that, but... Don't quite have enough for the Blue Covenant ring. If you make it back. I'll do that some other time. How's my defense looking? <laughs> Much better. Eh, 
Yeah, pretty good physical defense. All right. Sorry, Blue Covenant, you're going to have to wait. So let's go down there. Let's kill a few rats. Let's repair my Blue Covenant ring. Hope I don't get summoned again, I guess. Or if I do, just die easily and don't run through puddles of doom. Still don't understand what's actually happening there. Oh well. Feels, seems like it's going to keep happening. I'm not sure why it's happening so much now when it never happened before. Oh, stop laughing. It's not funny. Oh, shit. Yeah, somebody pointed out, um, when you're really close to them and I attack with this weapon... Hold on, let me back up a bit, like from here. Yeah, I see 270. Okay, so when you're really close to them and you attack them, like this, um, you actually don't hit them with the end of the blade and it actually does less damage. It seems to be about half damage compared to um, if you hit them at the, like, the very tip. So if you hit somebody when you're really close, it actually doesn't do much damage. So range is very important. This, this weapon gives me range, but... At the same time, I kind of have to be at range if I want it to be efficient, otherwise it does. Not very much. Okay. Oh, that's, a, that's enough for me to go repair the thing. Alright, let's go do it. Then like a little soul farming. Get the juices flowing. All the juices. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I hate fighting in water. You just move so slow. I suppose I should take my ring off when I'm not actually using it. The, the cat ring. Because it actually does have some weight. And if I'm not actually falling, it doesn't matter. I'll be around if you make it back. Okay, so now that I've got almost no souls, now is a very good time to experiment with something. That something being whether I can jump across here. Whee! Oh no, my 50 souls! Actually, I can just recover them. I, I think I can just recover them. Should be right where I jumped off. I think. Gonna lose a little health each time, of course, but not much. It'll be fine. There they are. Okay, so that didn't work out too well. Yeah, it seems like after you fall off... Your dodge doesn't really give you a lot of forward momentum. I don't think that's possible. I don't think that's gonna work. But if you fall down from above, I think that might work. Maybe. Maybe. And I'm gonna find out. Gotta go from above again. Yeah, there's no better time than right now to do this because I have no souls, don't care. Virtually nothing to lose. So if I fall just straight down here, I think I'll be okay. Yeah, okay. And of course, I could keep going down. But let's see what's in here first. 
Get up there super fast. Double time. Whoa. It's a door. I'm kind of scared. What might be behind it? There's only one way to find out what's behind a door. Of course, that's to use x-ray vision to see what's inside, or hack into the security cameras. Eh, I think I'll just open it. It's locked. Oh, fuck you! Okay. What's it locked with? Like, any information? What? Like, like it seems to need a, some sort of a rune shaped like a cow or something. Anything would be helpful. Alright, I guess I don't have the key. We All right. No, I don't want to do that. Try jump attack. Jump attack. How about just jump? All right. Here we go. Mm, too far. I've got to know what's down there. Too many mysteries to leave unsolved. I invested into this ring, and I'm going to use it. Oh my god, I feel like I'm getting... Oh, I am getting closer and closer to death every time, because my maximum health keeps going down. Ooh. I actually might not be able to live this one more time. I, maybe. I could just roll to it, but maybe I can't. Oh, fuck! I did the same thing. I shouldn't have jumped. I, I don't even need to jump, I don't think. I think I can just run to it. Okay. Might not be able to make the fall this time. I hate to burn an effigy just to get down there. In fact, I probably wouldn't. Well. I don't know. Maybe I would. Got like nine of them. Okay, please don't kill me. Please, please, please. Oh, fuck. Well, now I'm certainly not gonna make it. I missed. <sighs> this entire first episode, or this, this one episode here, is gonna just be me falling down a hole endlessly and getting killed by other people. It's okay. That's Dark Souls. Yeah, I wonder, if you recover your last life like this, even if you didn't actually have any souls, do you get your health back? No, I don't think you do. Yeah, okay. Hmm... How many do I have again? Nine. Eh. It's fine. It'll buy me what? Five more tries?
Okay. Yeah, see, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Ring of the Evil Eye plus one. Ooh. I'm intrigalized. What mayhaps does thou ring doest? Absorbs HP from each defeated foe. And it's a plus one, so I guess that means it's extra good? Anyway, uh, what ring do I not need? Hmm... I don't want that one to always be there. I won't have to use my reverse hollowing thing as much. Um, I'll just leave it for now. I'm not fighting anybody, so what's the point? Hurrah for below. Indeed. I guess I'll just drop down. Try jumping. Jumping to... Jumping to what? <laughs> Let's see. I bet this person tried jumping. Let's see. They really had to contemplate that one. Like, hmm, maybe should I, should I, yeah, I'm gonna jump to my death. Or, or walk off to my death, rather. I did it! Congratulations. I'll write that one up. Good job. How'd you die? I don't, I don't get it. What are they, do they think there's something down there? Because it just looks like an endless hole to me. Okay, how did you die? <laughs> you also died by running off. Did nobody die from the room itself? Gorgeous view ahead. Ooh. You better not be trolling. Looking for traps. A raw for jumping. Hmm, seems safe. Oh, it's one of those little things. Hi, I'm not going to attack you. You're cute. Hmm, I'm not really sure this is a gorgeous view. Kind of just looks like a broken, muddy place. I'm, uh, I'm not impressed. Be wary of nimble one or death ahead. Do you mean this tiny thing? Ring ahead and then sadness. <laughs> Oh god. Aw, oh, I just got some fall damage. And now it's running into a wall, and now it just disappeared. Alright, well apparently there's a ring ahead and then death. Hmm. Okay, that's a problem. Can I jump over it? I don't see any other way. Okay. Let's get a running start. That wasn't too bad. Oh, I can probably jump to that, too. But if I miss, I'm going to fall down, and then I'll never be able to get to it again. I'm certainly not doing that whole jumping process to get all the way down here, so let's just open this. Uh, please don't be like a trap. Okay, it's not. Ash Knuckle Ring. Okay, well, there's the ring. Where's the sadness? Increases petrification resistance. Uh, is that implying I can be petrified? This one was also worn by Roy the Explorer. It's a very prolific explorer. Petrification is tantamount to death, and in that sense, this knuckle ring is the charm that may save your life. Hmm. Okay. I almost feel like I should wear it now, in case a new enemy type comes in and starts to try to petrify me. Do I need the cat ring anymore? Am I gonna get... Uh, I'm gonna get damaged if I fall down here, so I probably should keep the cat ring. Okay, let's try to get to there. Fuck, 
with this with this thing here, it's gonna be hard. Okay, can I sprint in this short distance? Yes. Oh! I hear something. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> I pressed the wrong key. Also, I didn't know that they're suiciders. Jesus. Okay. Um. Well, I don't need to worry about being petrified by them. I just need to worry about being blown up. Right. I don't really want to go down there. I'm really curious what's down there, but... Is that the only way to get down there? Because if it is, that is a bitch. Dim horns. My god. I've seen that person before. Or at least somebody with the same... Helmet. Hmm. Yeah, learned a new attack, by the way. Nope, that, that's not it. There we go, that's it. It's the shield break. Didn't know how to do it before. But yes, there's actually a special move that allows you to break through somebody's shield defense. Right there. It's neat. Haven't used it yet, haven't needed to. Okay, do I want to do that again? I mean, I have high health right now. So... Eh, what the hell. I don't really want to do it again, but I kind of do. What the fuck? The fuck was that? Never mind, I don't want to go down there anymore. I've lost my adventurous spirit. <laughs> oh. Right. So, there's a lot of places I can explore. However, there's something I want to do first. I want to go back to the tutorial area and look at those headstones. Um, because I never really paid attention to what they said too much, because at the time I wasn't using a controller, and all of the tips involved controller buttons, so they didn't make a lot of sense. So I'm going to do that again, but uh, it's obviously going to be boring to watch, so I'm going to cut it out. So, I'll be right back. There we go. Redid the tutorial section. I don't think I missed anything that I didn't... I, I didn't notice anything that I didn't already know. Um, I also decided to fight those hippo things again, and guess what? They killed me. Again, I still have no idea how to fight them, and I don't care. They're pieces of shit, and I never want to see them again. Okay, now there's a bunch of different places I can go, but before starting basically a new area, because I can go to the Grave of Saints, or I can go to the No Man's Wharf, both areas I've barely been to. But before doing that, I remember that there's a place that I didn't quite finish. Um, is it here? Soldier's Rest? Cardinal's Tower? Hold on, where's this? I know it's over in this area. I'm not exactly sure which bonfire is closer to it. Oh, yeah. Here. Uh, no. Yeah, no. This one's closer. There's the area where the knight said there's uh, a treasure, but it's guarded or something like that. That place I have not been to. So let's head there. Let's kill this guy for funsies. Faster on the draw than you, Tex. Alright, I want to test out this shield break thing as well. This thing. 
Which, by the way, I tested on. I tested that on a basic enemy in the. Tur Ugh. Let me try that again. I tested that on a basic enemy in the tutorial area, and it uh, it does not do any damage. So it only breaks their defense. It will not actually hurt them. So something worth keeping in mind. Well, oh, didn't quite hit. I think this calls for an AoE. Maybe not. Too slow. Okay, I just did something. What did I just do? I accidentally switched out my life gems. There we go. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's test on this guy. He didn't even have his guard up, actually. I don't know why I just tried to use it. No point. Whoops. Oh, I do have the ring on, by the way. That gives me health for every kill. Yeah, that was another inefficient hit, because I need to be further away. Another inefficient hit. Another inefficient hit. Come on. Oh god. I need to relearn how to fight these guys. Yeah, I'm fighting them too close up. Gotta get the range right. Anyway, so this is where I've not gone. I'll leave this one to you. I'm worried about what might be inside. And I heard that this thing closes behind you. Oh god. I'm still fighting them too damn close. Indeed, it does close behind you. Hollow ahead, eliminating one at a time. Ooh, my halberd's taking a beating. I just realized it's not doing too good. Ambush ahead. That does not surprise me. Oh. back in the swing of fighting these guys. I got it. I got it. I got it. I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, one problem with them, though, is that they really like to dash towards you, which is bad for keeping them at just enough range to get the most efficient hits on, on them. See a bow guy up there. Ar aromatic ooze. Ew. That sounds disgusting. Where is it?
Apply magic to right hand weapon. Ooh. What kind of magic? A mysterious sticky substance that radiates a pale white light. The affected weapon inflicts ma magic damage for a short time, particularly effective against heavily armored foes or creatures with thick scales. Good to know, so I'm going to save that for boss fights. Come on. <sighs> Come on. Where's the other one? I did it. Congratulations. Let's try it out. No, 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 no. I tried the break thing. Fucked it up. Kinda worked, but it kinda happened after he already attacked me, so... Yeah. It's gotta be used on people that I think are quite slow to attack. Because... I mean, look at how slow the attack actually is. <laughs> like, it's like, that's a good couple seconds. Also, I need to switch my weapon. This thing's about to break. Okay. Mm, what should I do? Probably greatsword, I guess. Or a broad a bastard sword, I mean. Sure. Should be fine. Let's see what the attacks are like for this thing. Now, what's the big attack? Is it a stab? No, okay, it's a short range swing. Liar ahead. Oh, I'm up above on this thing. Wait. I already went up on that side, so this... I, I thought there's supposed to be treasure in here. That's it? I don't see no treasure. Nope. No treasure in there. Seems like they're giving you the opportunity to do a stabbing attack on this guy. Almost like you're supposed to kill him. It's very curious. Hmm. Well, I see you managed to escape. I hope that brave warrior didn't come a cropper either. Be careful out there. There's talk of unsavory bandits who prey upon travelers like yourself. Oh. But you should take this. Mm -hmm. It allows undead to call out for help to one another across the fissures between worlds. With luck, somebody will lend you a hand. Mm. Well, be careful. 
I think that allows me to summon people, right? What's it look like? Yeah, leave a summon sign. Be summoned as a phantom to another world in order to help the world's master for a certain time. You will be rewarded with a token of fidelity for successfully assisting the other player. Okay. A token of fidelity. That's cool. Uh, where might somebody need assistance? I don't know. I could put it down here, I guess. I don't know how long it lasts or what, but let's give it a shot. <laughs> Not sure if somebody would actually want to use it here, but... Summon me. I'm waiting. Ah. Okay, well, I think this area is... Whoops. Pretty well explored. I don't relish the thought of going over there again. <laughs> that actually might... That actually might kill me. Now that I don't have my uh, cat ring on. on my weapon again. Back to good old Halby. Okay, now the question is, where do I want to start to explore? Do I want to explore in this horrible spot or the No Man's Wharf? Let's go to the horrible spot, because I want to use my Ferris's Lockstone. Aw, my summoning sign disappeared. I guess because I left the area. <laughs> 